Hello, my captains, and welcome now to Tuesday. Well, partly sunny and hyper aware of your reality, the tuning planet of our emotions, the moon, has now moved out of Taurus and into Gemini today. What that does is put emotional focus on your moment. This is the sector of consciousness responsible for awareness as we understand it here in the sixth senses of reality. This is the Virgo consciousness. And so you will be very aware of your lifestyle and your life today. And this is a transit where I find some souls will light cast a dis-ease because they're emotionally kind of high strung and they haven't dealt with it. So when your emotions merge with your awareness, you can actually let that hemorrhage into other areas and your consciousness kind of co-affects your consciousness. In the same suit, if you've been sick and your, light and your body is not happy with you, well now you'll be very aware the volume will be turned up. So the best thing to do today after a powerful light cast day is to invest a little love vibration into yourself. You know, our heart, the moon, is our capacity for love. It's the tuning fork of it. So fill your heart with love, fill your whole vibration with love today, and fill your lifestyle with love, and watch things heal. Watch the flowers perk up like an ET, right? Now yesterday was light cast day, and today we follow suit with that energy. Sun in Taurus, trying to get Capricorns closer to their inner child, closer to their dreams, closer to their soul contract here on the earth. Yesterday was a big pulse of energy going out. Today, the sun logs in to Neptune. Now, Neptune is the tuning planet really of our higher self. It is the tuning planet of Pisces. So when the sun and Neptune come together, we're kind of forced to log into our board of spirits up there and hopefully download. Now, for some of us that are not in a meditative state who don't have a practice like that, it may just come through as creativity. You'll have a great idea, a creative idea. Same source. But if you do some light casting or some meditating today, you'll find that you get a lot of answers to your questions, and I recommend you put them out there, especially around issues of making your dreams come true. That is the agenda this month. One last thing I want to point out. The moon today will be also crossing over Mercury in the sector of lifestyle consciousness and squaring Saturn, which means you might have some fears bubble up between good health and a happy lifestyle and your overall religion or philosophies of life at large. Potential conflict between philosophy and lifestyle. All right, Cappy, that's all I have for the day. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be.